Good morning, guys. Uh, this might take two because my take one I totally rambled for like four minutes So I'm gonna try and concentrate this time so that you guys can watch this and get on with your day And start praying for the things that are going on down here. So thank you over the last week um, I headed out to Lily's house to have lunch every Friday She opens her house from like 12 p.m. to 12 a.m. and has people over to have lunch to sit down and just have some time together I had a good time. I normally take pictures. I didn't get that done this year. I'm, uh, I have a new phone I just need to get it set up so sorry, I apologize. I also uh, headed out uh, Friday, not I, but we, because I went out with the church youth group and then the church on Saturday to hand out invites to service because Sunday was Easter. Uh, we saw a lot of new faces. Uh, Easter morning, uh, a lot of people raised their hand and, and said the prayer to accept Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior, and cu including our maintenance man, Chewy Ravella. So welcome to the family, Chewy. Uh, it's pretty exciting. Uh, I also headed over to Texas to a little town called Socorro with Joel and Bianca. Uh, they invited us over to speak for their missions night. Uh, Joel uh, gave a little message and talked about just what we're doing at Amigo Fiel and how people could get involved. Uh, it was a nice little evening. And um, let's see what's coming up. Oh, one other thing. Last night I had Martina and Sandra over. Thank you for praying for them. Their pregnancy has come along great. Um, and she's she's looking pretty good they got about a month month and month or two left and then they'll have a new baby boy Santiago uh, but we just talked about uh, making sure everything was ready for kids day celebration which is a holiday here in Mexico at the end of the month and we started talking about the summer and and what they want to do for the summer for the Sunday school program and they're doing a great job thank you for praying for them and then stuff coming up that you keep covered in prayer. There's um, there's a lot more police here around. I don't know, uh, I'm not sure why, but it could be because there's elections this year in Mexico. Uh, everything from local all the way through president of Mexico happens this year in July. And so I've seen a lot of people out in the street campaigning, uh, just chatting with people. So if you could keep them covered in prayer, uh, the country of Mexico as they, they vote for their next level of leadership. And then um, <clears throat> preparing for groups that are coming up. We've got a lot of groups this summer. I'm so excited that people are interested in uh, the kingdom in Juarez and in Mexico and helping us just get more souls saved. And uh, trying to just trying to get planned for that so that we can make a big impact for the kingdom. And then the last thing I wanted to let you know is that next week I will not be making a video. I'm going on vacation. Uh, my sister Donna and my cousin Alicia are coming down. Uh, they're heading over to El Paso and uh, we're going to hang out together for the week and, and do, I don't know what, we're, we're going to make it up as we go. And uh, I think we're going to come over to Juarez one day and, and have a look around and, and meet some of the people I work with so they can and see where I'm at and what I'm doing. But that, um, yeah, that's what's going on down here. Thank you guys for praying.